Well, state lawmakers represented Sarasota County held court today with more than 30 groups. They represent areas of government, education, health, and more. And they all shared their priorities in Tallahassee. As and local news reporter Grant Boxleitner was there and has more. The lawmakers who represent Sarasota County met in Sarasota today, and they were hearing from government and other local organizations about priorities for the upcoming session. State lawmakers who represent Sarasota County heard from reps of more than 30 local governments, schools, and other county organizations. All shared their wish lists for policy and funding priorities in Tallahassee. And at times, the discussion became heated, like when Sarasota County School District Superintendent Lori White voiced concerns about the state requirements for education, accountability, and assessment systems. I think we could wait for chaos to occur and then have to respond after the fact in a legislative session or with um, the state board rule, or we could thoughtfully work together. And I realize that you don't hold all the remedies. State Senator Nancy Dieter told White she found the use of the word chaos annoying. And then she had this to say. Don't show up and say we created chaos for you. Um, we'd like to hear from you. And, and when I call or if I talk to a school board member and say, what can I do for you? Uh, we need more money. That's not specific enough. You have to give us a specific charge and then we will work our hardest to get that done for you. Sarasota Memorial Hospital's Chief Operating Officer Dave Marinder urged lawmakers to support health care expansion, a measure that did not pass in 2013. It doesn't have to be Medicaid. Uh, it, it, we, we supported Senator Negron's plan uh, in this past year. Uh, and anything else that's a home ground uh, type plan that, that, that accomplishes getting the federal funding as well as the um, as well as getting the uninsured coverage is what we would support. Tourism is another major issue on the Sun Coast. Visit Sarasota County President Virginia Haley praised the legislature for increased funding for promoting state tourism. Florida is able to promote the entire state year round instead of seasonally or picking a few markets. We're piggybacking off of that. So it gives Sarasota greater exposure. We're stretching our dollars. And these legislators will take all of this information to Tallahassee over the next months. The regular session is scheduled to begin on March 4th. Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News. Now in South County, the Venice mayor requested to keep Bypass 41 expansion funding in place. Northport's mayor, meanwhile, asked for help to widen busy River Road. In the next half hour, we'll have more of the legislative delegation, including the support of one city to repeal the state's stand-your-ground law.